Was that slay or not? I think it was a slay. Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Tuomi Hit Tattoo here, and well, as you can see in the title of today's video, I'm gonna be getting yet another tattoo. If you're new here to my YouTube channel, hi. My name is Joelle, and I get tattoos whenever I'm sad, depressed, and going through it. And I'm in need of some ink therapy, so before we get into that, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so I can I post new videos. So, with that being said, let's get started. on my way to Mantica right now so I can get tattooed by my coworker, and I'm like running late so I'm just frantic as fuck right now and I'm just trying to speed my way to Mantica so I can get there on time so hopefully he's not mad at me I just I know how punctual he is I know how punctual I am but today it's just been a rough morning okay and I'm also getting probably the most painful tattoo today I'm getting my inner bicep tattooed so I'm very frantic I'm scared I am very nervous and I just I there's a lot going on Before you start talking your shit, just know, just know, priorities. As I was complaining literally about getting here late, I, I made it a point to go to Starbucks. And I'll do it again. Like I frantically said earlier, today I'm gonna be getting my inner bicep tattoo, which is potentially the most painful tattoo that I've gotten to this point. I mean, I've gotten both my knees tattooed, but like everybody says, it sucks. So I'm already kind of putting my mindset in that, thinking that it's like, okay, this is gonna be a shitty tattoo to endure. So today's Monday, I have to work tomorrow. And then on Wednesday, I finish up the tattoo, potentially, if we don't get it all done today. The last time I did a back-to-back -back session like that was when I got my half sleeve by the same artist, so Polly. So I'm like kind of nervous, but also, it's gotta get done. My left sleeve is what we're gonna be continuing on today. So the theme of this sleeve is Latin glamour because I am Latino, Chicano, and I enjoy the glamour. Okay, I enjoy the telenovela drama. I love it, I live for it. So today what we're gonna be doing is a perfume bottle, if not like a cologne bottle, like a vintage perfume bottle, reads as a perfume bottle, especially in black and gray. So that's kind of what I'm thinking for the inner bicep. I really just let Sopali kind of have free range on this because I wanted to make sure that he, of course, has his creative freedom with the design, with the sleeve and everything. As long as it represents Latin glamor, I'm here for it. Update. Okay, so I'm just gonna let you know this shit fucking hurts. Like <laughs> it really hurts. I'm in the bathroom right now hiding because I was like, I know as soon as I get back out there, it's gonna be nothing but pain. Because it's already pain. He still has to get all up in my armpit and I know it's gonna hurt. <laughs>
Okay, let's have a little bit of a chat. As you can see, I didn't finish my tattoo today. Like I told you earlier, it's actually gonna be a two-part session. I genuinely don't know how I'm gonna do it because today I was already going through it. Mind you, I'm pretty good about pain. Like I've gotten my knees tattooed, I've gotten different parts of my leg tattooed, I've gotten my arm tattooed, all of that. But for whatever reason, the inner bicep just hurts so fucking bad. So I'm gonna hit up Freddy to see if he has any numbing cream that I could use. Cause like, I mean, we all know. I shit on Freddy for using numbing cream. I shit on like a lot of people for using numbing cream, but like dead ass. I'm gonna be one of those people. Cause I genuinely don't know how else I would get through this tattoo. Yeah. Freddy, let me buy the cream. Do you have your inner bicep tattooed? Not yet. Exactly, exactly. Okay, well, as you can see, we are back at the tattoo shop. Today, I'm gonna be finishing up my inner bicep tattoo. Like I showed you guys yesterday, it was kind of inflamed. Today, she's still a little inflamed and like, you know, there's a lot of redness in here, but for the most part, the tattoo's grayed out um, and it's gotten to that point of like healing where it's gonna potentially heal within the next few days. So I just hope that today I don't die. Monday was such an uncomfortable, unreal, out of body experience. Like, I, I ne I've never truly experienced anything quite like that. Fuck it, so Polly put a white highlight straight up right here on my armpit. Like, what kind of menace to society is he? I just hope that today, with the numbing cream that I got from Freddy, that I don't die. I made it through my tattoo alive. Literally, I did not think this tattoo was ever gonna end. Luckily, today's session was so short, to be completely honest, and because of this numbing cream, I like really can't complain. If I did not have this, I know for a fact, I'd be in a shit lot more pain. Just know, if you ever get your inner bicep tattoo, that shit is spicy. Unfortunately, I still have my inner bicep. I also have my knee ditches, the back of my thigh, and a bunch of other uncomfortable areas that I know I'm probably gonna end up getting tattooed in the future, but for now, if you want to get tattooed by Soul Poly, hit him up. His at is Tattoos by Soul Poly. He is an amazing artist. I am so lucky to be friends with him and to work with him. Anyway, guys, if you made it to this point of the video, please give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps me out a lot. I bring you tattoo-related content every single week. So with that being said, thank you again so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Later.